welcome back again to my kitchen today i'm going to wig up some cow foot jamaican style curry cow foot in my kitchen any day of the week all right so now if you don't want to see all me wig up this thing here come on and let's do this now because it's the indian oh. mm. All right, now right here I have three pounds of cow foot. I washed it thoroughly with vinegar and lemon juice. So make sure sun and clean will not touch up them thing here. All right, nice wash clean vinegar and lemon juice. Now let me show you the ingredients that I'm going to use to cook up this thing. I'm going to use this curry powder. This is a Jamaican choice. Pimento seed, salt, any kind of seasoned salt to have in your house. You can use any kind of garlic you got in your kitchen, whether you have the dry garlic, the old garlic, or the chopped garlic. Just use whatever you have. You're gonna need thyme. This is a dry thyme. If you have the fresh thyme, use that. And black pepper. But remember, guys, very important, you're gonna need butter bean. If you don't have the butter bean, you use a lima beans. No. This is what I'm going to get this dish started off with. Later on, I'm going to show you what I'm going to add to it when the dish is finished. I'm adding one teaspoon of garlic, black pepper, curry powder. Just put about two teaspoons of curry powder in there. I'm just going to put a few pimento seeds in as well. Salt. About a teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning and some dry thyme and again if you don't have dry thyme use a fresh one this is going to taste the same way crazy flavor now I'm just going to give this a spin what I'm going to do here is because comfort I'm going to tend to take long to cook so instead of putting it on the stove top I'm going to put it into my pressure cooker and then I'm going to let this cook for about 40 minutes 40 minutes we take it out and put it in the next pot big pot and finish it up with the seasoning my onion my skin and my thyme more more flavors all right now here you go guys i'm going to go ahead and put the cow foot into the pressure cooker in the pressure cooker i have about eight cups of water in here all right cold water because if you put warm water into the pressure cooker it now a shot so Cold water, eight cups, depending on the size of your pressure cooker. This is a big pressure cooker I have here. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that in. Then I'm going to close it tight and get it going. Now, this is going to be on the fire for 40 minutes. No pause 40 minutes because after 40 minutes, I'm going to take it off and finish cooking it on the stove top. So see you back in All 40 right guys, minutes. So my cow foot is nice and tender. I cooked it for about 45 minutes into the pressure cooker. So now I'm just all I'm doing now is just transferring from the pressure cooker to the pot. So I'm gonna turn it down on medium heat. Because now I'm, all I'm doing is gonna simmer. Add my ingredients One in and let onion. it simmer. One Jamaican scotch bonnet pepper. Don't open it, just drop it in. Sweet pepper. One stalk of scallion and my tomatoes I'm just putting all that in and then the next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and add my butter beans in and again if you don't have butter bean you can use a lima bean same thing the only thing is that one is bigger than the other but you're going to get the same flavor now I'm going to go ahead and put some butter in and I'm just going to add just a little bit, not much, of butter. If you have margarine, you go and add and add your margarine in. Now, I don't need to add any more spices because I already spiced it up from earlier before it went under pressure. But give it a test taste, maybe you might need some more salt. Maybe you might need a little bit more spices if you want to put it in. But I'm not going to put anything so in here. Now, all I'm just going to this. do is just let this simmer for no more than 20 minutes and within 20 minutes it's going to be simmered nice and succulent and ready to eat so All see right, it minutes. must look like this 
This is Jamaican style cow foot with butter bean. If your husband want a baby, this is the thing we have to feed him pan. For a good month, and let me tell you, must have a baby. So here it is. I'm going to put this on a plate and let you guys see how we combine this dish together. So see you back in like three here, minutes. Here go guys, once again, Jamaican style curry goat foot, okay? So with butter bean. Now, don't forget to subscribe and like. Let me know what you want to see me cook next in the kitchen. And as always, from my kitchen to your kitchen, 